we are using more and more energy. In the past decade, our energy consumption has grown tremendously. We are reaching a point where we are using up the natural resources of the earth faster than they can be renewed. The environment is changing too. We have seen catastrophic fires, hailstorms, floods, rivers running red, choked with dust. Fossil fuels are finite. They're also contributing to environmental pollution, climate change, and is fueling wars and political unrest. Renewable energies can offer clean and politically independent energy, but they are not reliable. If the wind doesn't blow, the energy doesn't flow, and there is no sunshine at night when energy consumption is at its highest. The future of renewables relies on technologies that store and regulate energy. Thermal energy storage is crucial. It is crucial to cover the base electrical load when the renewable source is not available. The heat storage medium is key. Heat can be stored in molten silicon, bricks, concrete, water or ethylene glycol but cost, availability and heat capacity limit their use. Sand is cheaper than all other storage media and chemically inert. Australia is the world leader in sand. 35% of Australia is effectively desert and 20% is covered in sand. 1,371,000 square kilometres. To put this in perspective, the whole of Greater Sydney is only 12,000 square kilometres. Our sand covered land is 115 times bigger than this. The solar energy hitting the earth each year exceeds the total energy consumed by humanity by more than 20,000 times. Research carried out at Emirati Khalifa University has been successful in storing solar energy in sand. The smart city of Mazda uses parabolic mirrors with a concentration ratio of a thousand suns that generates temperatures of over a thousand degrees Celsius focused on a small area to heat sand falling through a cylinder. It then uses that heat as a store for future production of power. Sand at 600 degrees Celsius in an area of one hectare and 20 meters deep can hold renewable energy the equivalent of four and a half thousand tons of coal or 10,000 megawatt hours. All the surplus power production from wind, tide and solar can be stored in the sand providing reliable, clean, renewable energy.